Hello, patrons of Game and Wildlife, this is your director. So I played some Warframe, uh, and I'm waiting on Mike to get online, because I don't know what I'm doing. So instead, I thought I would play some Magic while I'm waiting for him. And uh, you know the deck, you know the rules, it's Delver of Secrets. He's awesome. Everybody loves Delver. Everybody loves Delver. Don't you dare say otherwise. Uh, you've seen me play this deck before, and so now you've seen me play it again. So ladies and gentlemen, let's get our modern on... Okay, I think we're ready to go. Uh, Alright, so let's... Well, I need to figure out... Oh, 20. Uh, good luck, have fun to you. Mm -hmm. Very nice person. Alright, and we begin with... Spell Snare, Steam Vents, Islands... Turn. Yeah! Uh, four lands. Four lands is iffy, but I've got Visions, Spell Snare, and Delver. I think that's going to be a decent one. So I'll, even though it's four lands, I'm going to keep it. Um, he's going to keep it. Okay. So then I will play Island into Mr. Delver. End turn. Let's see what we got. We've got Cavern. Oh, no. <laughs> Not Cavern of Souls. That's actually going to hurt me a lot. Humans. Oh, are we are we facing mono white humans, or hate bears, or white weenie? One of those. Okay. No. Untap. Upkeep. Look at the top cards of my library, and we reveal. Snappy. Uh, choose not to reveal then. Draw Snappy. He's always good. Um, I'm gonna... Yeah, we'll put a Tarn out just in case. Um, swing with Delver. Take one. Second main phase. Serum Visions. To draw one. Hey, peasy. And then... View top two. Hey, we'll put Bolt on top. No. I'm going to have to... Damn it. I'll have to shuffle Scalding Tarn later. Shit. Uh, I should have done this different. I should have played Steam Vents and I'm stupid for not. Okay. Yeah. Alright, fine. We'll put Bolt on top. We'll move Snappy to the bottom and then I won't fetch for land until next turn. Future Ian, I made a mistake. Go ahead and put it up. Should have fetched for land before doing thing stuff. You know what I you know what the mistake was. What we got? First main. Ghost Corp. Oh! Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna... Yeah, I hate to do this, but... I really hate to do this, but... That's not gonna happen. Uh, I'm gonna bring in Steam Vents. Spell Snare. Thalia. Yeah, I hate to do that, but... Thali is going to make my... Yeah, this is Hate Bears. God damn it. Hate Bears is tough. Alright. View top cards of the library. Blood Moon. Uh, instant or Sorcery. Nope. Uh, well, actually, that's going to help me out a bit. Draw. Blood Moon. In fact, that's going to help me out immensely. So why don't I Scalding Tarn, Sack 16... View library for another island, and then boom, guess what I get to play? Blood Moon! Boom! All of them are red. So yeah, these are these are mountains now. <laughs> yes. Uh attack. Enter. I didn't play PZ, but I don't really need PZ. Uh, I suppose I can do Snapcaster into... So all those are mountains. <laughs> yeah, I don't think... Uh, I'm not sure what he can do at this point. Uh, untap, upkeep, view top card, Vapor Snag. I shall reveal Vapor Snag. 
flip delver. Draw vapor snag. And first main phase. Um, we're going to put down steam vents untapped just in case. Uh, start with, yeah, may as well put a counter on there to remind me that it's a mountain. Start with PZ. I probably wasn't the best play, but anyway. Swing for three. And end step. Got vapor snag ready and raring to go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, the the problem is if you throw down a blood moon and they've got a bunch of um, uh, non basics, it's just gonna be really tough for them. Uh, so I think he needs to build his sideboard. I'll just run this back in the board if you want. Uh, oh, so he's going to run that again? Well, that's, that's not entirely fair for me to... You know what? I'm not going to sideboard. He, he doesn't have a sideboard for this, so I'm not going to run it. It's not fair for me to just be like, oh, there's sideboard this in. So I guess we'll just get a couple of games out of it. We'll see. Uh, Sulphur Falls, Island, Mainland. Yeah, this looks good. This looks great. I'll keep it. Start with an island into Delver of Secrets, and they'll be able to play a second one. He's got Secret on the Coast. Okay, that was weird. Uh, reveal hand to him. Look at what I have. I have Delvers, I have Snappies, I have Vapor Snag, I have Mana Leak, and two lands. Now he's going to put throw it on Seacrum Coast. Aether Vile. God damn it. Okay. Uh, draw. Probe. And throw down Mr. Delver. And then I shall the taxi and probe you. And draw a card. What you got? Plains, Ghost Quarter, Flooded Strand, Brimaz. And another Aether Vial. Hmm. Okay. That's going to be tricky. I think I can get him, so... Oh, he knows I have Mana Leak and Vapor Snag. Well. It's an advantage. A small advantage on his part, but I think I'm going to be okay. On combat. So at the beginning... Yeah, there you go. Put one... Draws a card, and for main he's got flooded strand, secret coast, another aether vial, and then flooded strand, ends turn. Okay, so now he's at least got Brimaz, so I should probably keep a mana up just in case. So untaps, upkeep, top card. What do we got? Hey, it's Probe. I'll put that in there and create myself a Delver into Insectile Aberration. Draw the Gataxian Probe. Play Sulphur Falls. Combat. Swing. Okay, got three. Second main phase. Yeah, let's throw that in like a taxi and probe. I'm still ahead on life, so I'm not too worried about it. So what you got for me? Sarah of... Uh, <laughs> I'm unhappy. Oh, shoot. If he gets that up to two, he can just throw Sarah Avenger in there. I just got young Pyromancer. Shoot, 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 shoot. Um, see, I'm taking a risk right here, because he can basically flash in uh, that guy and flash in that guy. And then I can flash out Vapor Snag and Man Leak. 
probably okay. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hold on to Manalik in case he tries to cast Brimaz. Yeah, I'm gonna hold on to Manalik in case he tries to cast Brimaz. Okay, he's gonna fetch. Go for an island. Really? Just an island? Okay. One taps. Upkeep. Put one, put one. Yeah. Draw. Okay, Sarah Avenger. Good card. Problem for me, because it's flying and I'm flying. Come on, put in Sarah Avenger. Come on, throw down Brimaz. Do something. Untaps. Draw. Hey, hey! No, I can't bolt him. I can bolt him. Tarn. Not snag. Yeah, I want to throw down PC. Um... Start combat. Okay. Attack. Block. View library for... The card that's going to help me here, Mountain, Lightning Bolt, your Sarah Avenger. Boom! Gotcha. Unless you got a counter spell. Sincerely doubt it. I mean, you might have a counter spell. Hate Bears usually doesn't run counter spells, though. Delver versus Hate Bears. Thinking. Go ahead. I am tapped out. One, two, three. Spell Queller? <laughs> you son of a bitch. Alright. Yep, they kill each other. Mm-hmm. I know, I know. Hello. And red. Second main phase. I got nothing. Shit. This is bad. This is very, very bad. What are you dropping in for one? You're not dropping in anything. Okay, so he's got his planes in there. That ghost quarter and Brimaz. They're going to be issues. They're going to be problematic, to say the least. Start combat. Second main. Okay. What, uh, what you doing there? Okay. On taps. Drum. Hey, hey, Delta. Perfect. Hmm. Move these over here. Let's see. View graveyard. I've got two probes and a delver. It's not going to really help me for snappy. I'm going to get my lightning bolt back. Vapor snag. Spell queller. What's the play? Sure. Okay. Then you lose one off a of snag. Oh. Okay. Well, we'll cast bolt then. 
Hitch of three. Both of them. Has those bolts. Okay. Okay. Uh, actually, you know what? Mana leak spell caller. Ah. Man, I hate hate bears. Man, I hate this deck. It's mean. Okay, end turn. Let's let's see what this figures. Man. Stupid. So Ghost Core is already in play. Man, Spellcaller's a son of a bitch. Hallowed Fountain. Give me back my lightning bolt. Declare attackers. Take two. Second main. What you doing? And okay. Wait, an upkeep. Still at end step. Still at end step. P library. Yeah, I want to get my steam vents out. Untap, upkeep, pay for three. Okay. Reflector mage. Let me think this for a moment. Vapor snag. He has to resolve. Turn. That creature's owner can't cast spells with the same name as that creature until his next turn. Man, Reflector Mage, Spell Queller. This is a terrible. No, it's a great deck, but it's a deck I don't like. Okay. draw. Alright. Double Delver, huh? Maybe a single Delver. Yeah, I'll just put a single Delver out there. See if I can't figure out a way to deal with all this. You know, this may not be the best idea, but I'm going to do it anyway. Snapcaster Mage. Wait, if I wait, oh. Wait, did I already cast Vapor Snag? I am stupid. I am very stupid. That should be an exile. I guess like a few turns ago. Forget if. Okay. All right. So yeah, let's snag. Bell Queller. Bolt to Reflector Mage. Hmm. 
One, two, three. Keep trying to get that thing away from you. It's not working. And step. What you got? Three elementals. Delver and Snappy. Hmm. You still have Brimaz. I'm guessing you're waiting to use him until you can... Well, you can hard cast him now and be pretty much okay. Man, hate bears is tough. Take two. Um. Block one. All right. He dies. And Brimaz. No! Son of a bitch. What are you... Yeah, of course you would. Untaps. Draw. Oh, look, I have three of them in my hand. Woo! The only play I can make. Why peasy? End step. <laughs> That's all I can do. Yeah, you would. I'm in a severe disadvantage. Yeah. Uh, let's say game three. I don't think I was going to be able to get anything out of it. Game three. Please. Please for game three. All right. Uh, mind if I sideboard? Because, yeah, it was... I mean, you don't have to. No problem. Okay, let me let me take a look here. Relic. Uh, that's not really gonna help. Uh, I need I need Vandal Blast. I really do. To basically just be like destroy that thing. Spell Skite. Pankin. Actually, now that I think about it, I think those are the only two that can help me. Maybe Roast. Yeah, he's just gonna start casting stuff with Aether Vial, and I need to destroy Aether Vial. Um, Roast would be. This deck has potential somewhere. Oh, yeah, no! No, that's solid. Like, don't don't doubt yourself. Hate Bears is an awesome deck. <laughs> Seriously, really good. Hmm. Actually, Manlik's not really going to help me all that much. Just slays. Yeah, it does. Um. Yeah, counter spells are not going to help me here. So maybe I should leave the counter spells out. I need to destroy his Aether Vials. Yeah, Mana Lake's not really going to help me much. Okay, I'll play. Alright. One land. Oh, never keep a one lander. 
But I've got probe and snag. I got two probes. Ooh, okay. Never keep a one lander, but I'm gonna try this anyway. We're, we're gonna see. All right. Delta, sac, 19, library, into, steam vents, two more, tap, delver, probe, two more, boom. It's not burned, so I can do this and be pretty okay. Oh, oh my, Thalia, reflector mage, two paths, Oh boy. You know what I need? I need my Vandal Blast because he's got Aether Vial and that's going to be a problem for me. Well, I got my second land, so that'll work. Come on, Vandal Blast, what you doing? Probe me! What you got? Real hand. So he used his probe, the one I know about. Wastes. Aether Vial. Man, I need that Vandal Blast. Man, do I need that Vandal Blast. Pass. Untaps. Upkeep. Look at the top card. And we get Blood Moon. Yes. Mm, God, if I can get that out. It's going to throw him off significantly. Okay. But I need to get that out. That's the problem. Delta. Sac. 14. Go to library for an island. Since he's a beatdown deck and that's what uh, Hate Bears is, you can hurt yourself a bit more when it comes to mana. But you got to be careful when you're going up against like blue decks. Hurting yourself on mana is bad. Real bad. Oh, if I can get a third land, I can get Blood Moon and shut him out of the game. Mostly. Without Aether Vile, he's gonna... It's gonna be a problem for him. Hmm. Uh, attack. Swing. Second main. Yeah, we'll end step. I've got one just in case. He's gonna try and path Delver. Yeah, okay. I got a Blood Moon. What you gonna do? That's seven. Aether Vial. I'm not gonna allow it. Leak it. Ghost Quarter, huh? Hmm. What you waiting on? Just checking. Anything else? Thinking. Okay. Ending phase. All right. Untaps. Upkeep. Top card. Give me a... Give me Vandal Blast. Scalding Tarn. Good enough. Perfect. Good enough. Goes no. Laying Vial there was probably a fairly large punt. Uh, you had to. Y you just had to. Oh, 
Possibly, but you needed to anyway. Um, Blood Moon. Do you resolve Moon? Yeah. And then I play Violin in this turn. Then Ghost Court. Yeah, that's probably smart. Yeah, that's that's a that's a bad move, but it's also kind of his only move to be able to get around Blood Moon. So it, it's not the worst play, but yeah, let's uh, let's probe you for two. What you got? What you got in hand? Displacer, Path, Path, Reflector, Thalia. Yeah, unfortunately right now that is your best bet to be able to deal with this. Did I draw? No, I have not drawn. So I'll do there, there. Spell snare. Ah. He's going to throw out Thalia and I'm going to have to pay two to snag her. But then I can pay one to snare her. Well, that'll work. End step. And a counter. Okay. So yeah, ghost quartering your own dual land to avoid the Blood Moon lockout is a bad play, but it's a necessary play. You have to do it, otherwise Blood Moon's just going to lock you out of the game entirely. He's still got Aether Vial, and he can pump that up to be able to Reflector Mage something, or throw down Thalia. And he can still use that Plains to Path to Exile, so he's got, he's got a lot of options here. Uh, Displacer's basically just a 3-3, three, three. it's just an elephant at this point. Path to Exile? Yeah, it's probably your best bet. Exile him. I'm going to view my library. I'm going to view my library. Uh, let's, let's get an island. May as well. Uh, pass. Untaps. Draw. PZ. PZ is good peeps. Why PZ? Non creature spells. Now that affects him as well, so he can't path to exile something with only one land. Um. And step. So I'm going to have to pay two for Vapor Snag, which sucks, but. In response to ETB trigger, snag Thalia. Selfless spirit. Still. And then uh, lose one from snag. And then I make a elemental. Okay. In response to entering the battlefield. Yeah, it doesn't have an ETB trigger, but I can still respond to it entering the battlefield. Play a planes. Path to exile your own self with spirit. Yeah, that's probably your best bet. It sucks that you have to do that, but it's also very necessary. Otherwise, you're just going to have a bad time. See, the these are bad plays, but it's helping him, and he's still being able to keep himself afloat, so it's not inherently a bad thing. Draw. Mountain, hey, hey. Look at that. I can even Snapcaster and Mana Leak, or Snapcaster Vapor Snap. Good. Let's, uh, let's move to combat. There we go. Three. 
and then I'll end step. Everything can be cast at instant speed. Come on, what you got for me? I think you still got a Thali in hand, right? Thinking. Can't bounce the Aether Vial. Yeah, let's do targeting vapor snag. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. I've got vapor snag until end of turn. Reflector mage. Okay. Yeah. Yep, yep. Thinking. If he says vapor snag. Yeah, that was a bad choice for me. I should have waited and then I should... Yeah, I should have waited and then played. Oh, it was a dumb choice on my part. Now I'm going to spell snare it. Him. And then... Vapor Snag resolves... back here. Pass. Untaps. Draw. Tarn. Tarn. Hit shift for three. Reflector mage. Oh yeah. I'm still hitting you for three. Second main, we'll go ahead and throw out Tarn. Oh, yeah. Um. End step. Island, island, mountain. Where's my Vandal Blast? Thalia. Yeah, it's not that big of a deal right now. I think you still got Reflector Mage. Pass. Untap. Draw. Why, PZ? Why, PZ? Okay. Get the first one. Hmm. This is a very interesting style. If I, like, if I get out Blood Moon and Vandal Blast pretty early, I've got the game. If I don't, I have a lot of difficulty, it seems. See, I'm losing, but this is actually a great uh, learning opportunity for anyone who's watching this to see just how powerful a Hate Bears deck can be. Blue-White Hate Bears. Yep, another Aether Vial. Swing for three in the air. 
or two, uh, uh, yeah, two in the air. Pass, untap, screw. Land another blood moon. Uh, attack. Okay. I don't think I've got this. Second main and step. I think he might have it. I'm wearing a grab shirt. <laughs> Not doing too well. One, two. Probe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're about to see that I have dill in my hand. My hand is consistent of dill. Absolute dill. Yeah. yet. Peasy. Okay. Might win this non-creature. Bolt Thalia. No, shit. No, I'm stupid. Future Ian put it up. Should have bolted opponent, not Thalia. Attack. Well, I, I guess start combat. Okay. Attack. And he can just... Yeah, Eldrazi Displacer. Brimaz, son of a bitch. Uh, I'm gonna concede. Good games. I'm gonna concede. Good games. <laughs> Alright. Let's do a quick little recap. So... Hate Bears uh, is the deck that we face today. Uh, Hate Bears is typically built in one of two ways. There's an Eldrazi version, uh, which has become more popular as of late once the uh, blue-red Eldrazi deck was uh, banned from Modern. Well, it wasn't banned. The one card that was banned was uh, Eye of Ugin, rightfully so, because it basically allowed you to play your entire hand turn one, and that's just too bad. Uh... Well, that's, that's good. That's really good, but it's oppressive in the format. So then the Eldrazi, uh, like Thought Not Seer, sort of, uh, and Eldrazi's Displacer helped make a new deck called Hate Bears, a new version of Hate Bears. It used to be that Hate Bears was a mono-white deck, and you saw the original version with a couple of new cards uh, that I played today. It was sort of a white-blue Hate Bears with uh, Reflector Mage and Spell Queller to be able to come in uh, Brimaz is usually a popular beatdown creature. Um, and this particular deck it is just really... Like, the idea is to just hold your opponent back. Uh, it still loses to stuff like Jund, because Jund just keeps getting really good at card advantage and really powerful stuff. Uh, but in a Delver deck, if I can't... Uh, like, game one, I just need to get out Blood Moon, and I basically win. Uh, game two, if I get out uh, Vandal Blast... Which I have in my sideboard right over here, Vandal Blast. Get out Vandal Blast, maybe Roast. I should have put in Roast. I don't know why I didn't. The big problem is that counter spells are still nice against uh, Hate Bears, but they can kind of avert that with uh, Aether Vial. And if you can kill their Aether Vials and get down Blood Moon, you can essentially shut them out of the game, as you saw with Game 1. Uh, I wasn't able to do that and made a couple of mistakes here and there. 
future, and you probably picked up on those. But yeah, so that's Delver versus Hate Bears. I lost, but you learn some things, which is important when you're playing modern. So thank you for watching. Uh, please leave a like and a comment and subscribe, and we will see you next time when Game of Wildlife plays.